Hi, this is Ahmed with you from Mudir. If you find this video helpful, please like, share, and subscribe. In this video, we are going to learn how to import bank statements. To import bank statements, go to Bank and Cash Accounts, click on it. Then, there is an option here down called Import Bank Statement. Click on it. Then choose the bank account. For example, here it's ABC Bank. Click on Choose File to choose the bank statement from your PC. Click on Choose File. Then, this is an example here. Click on it. Click on Open. So, the format here is .csv. Click on Next. We've got the bank account name. Then, the system will gonna show you closing balance before import, then the number of transactions and the file, then the number of transactions already imported, then the number of transactions to import, then the closing balance after the import. Click on import to accept this step. Now, we've imported the bank statement to the system. The thing is, these transactions which is imported need to be edited. We can see here that we've got two options here, which is uncategorized receipts and uncategorized payments. That means that the system has imported these transactions from the bank statement itself, but he doesn't know how to deal with them. So we've got to help the system to categorize these receipts and payments. For example, we've got uh, four receipts. Click on them. We've got these transactions. We've got to edit these transactions. Click on edit. Here we've got to edit the transactions. Now we've got here paid by. For example, we've got to edit it. For example, we've got uh, deposit, which is coming from the customer. And we've got to write the name of the customer, for example. This is an example. Then the description is deposit. We can edit the transaction if we need. For example, here we've got here accounts receivable and the system has generated the name of the customer automatically depending on this name so we've got this amount which is generated from the bank statement itself scroll down if you don't need to adjust these amounts then click on update now we've got three to go also and we should edit these transactions upon our needs or you can edit these transactions as you need Go back to bank and cash accounts. We've noticed that the uncategorized receipts has decreased by one. The same you can do to the other transactions under this category and the other category also. And that's how we can import bank statements in Manager. If you find this video helpful, please like, share, and subscribe. And before we're saying goodbye, we're pleased to announce that we are now officially the resellers of manager cloud you can have a free trail of manager cloud subscription through the link in the description below this is ahmed with you from mudir thanks for tuning in have a nice and productive day